What's up guys? I'm gonna make mac and cheese. Simple home version. Mac and cheese come for food. Alright, that's the roux. So I got equal part there, I flour and some fat, some butter. And that's enough cooking that for us now. Just gonna take it off. Um, and then I get some milk, add some milk to that. Okay. Milk in there now. So now I'm gonna cook it slow. Got a little heat low. I've whisked, whisked it, make sure no solid bits. Make sure you get in the corners. And my pan is nice and thick. It's a thick pan, so it won't burn on the bottom. My temperature is low. Now I'm gonna cook it for a while. I'm gonna add a bay leaf in there. Okay, here's the bay leaf. I just add. A little bit thicker, still not thicker on the bottom, which is good. You can check, see a little bit of the solids there, the roux, still needs to be incorporated sometimes. It does clump up on the bottom. You need to mix around, make sure you get in the corners as well. Here's my pasta, my macaroni's there, my Cheese sauce is here. Still not done. Still cooking my cheese sauce. Scraping, making sure it doesn't burn. But getting ready. Okay, that's my sauce that's gonna be for my cheese. I'm adding this cheese here, Colby. Colby cheese, New Zealand dairy, New Zealand made. See? Now I'm gonna add my cheese now. Cheese. I didn't grate the cheese because I don't feel like washing the grater. So what I did is just sliced it. You can't see. Okay. Just sliced it. And it will melt. It will melt in there. Try to stand back. Too much smoky. Uh, definitely more cheese. See? More cheese, more cheese. Make your mac and cheese. You gotta have cheese, you know? Gotta have cheese. And cheese. Taste. Good. Mm. Nice stuff. Alright. Well, I decided to do like a like a garlic bread there. Garlic and herbs. Okay. Here's my Mac, my cheese sauce. You now, some cheese is salty, so after the cheese melts, it's nice and thick as well. Let's see, can you see? That was my finger, that's the mark. Um, I'll season it after my cheese is melted. And what happens if it gets too thick? I could add more milk. Okay. If it's too thin, well, you need to work on your roux and the quantity of milk you add. Right, look, nice and thick. Oh, that's good. Okay. Here's my cheese sauce. Here's my macaroni. Now I need to add the two. Um, when I do mac and cheese, I also keep a little liquid from cooking the pasta in there, in the bottom of the pasta, because we season, season the water, so there's a good amount of salt in there, and I don't really care about cooking the mac a little bit over, so can't really see it because obviously pasta absorbs uh, liquid and let's see if I can do this with one hand. Here we go. Boom. Alright. There's my sauce in the pan. Alright. See there? It's in my pan? Not burnt. Good. That's what we want to see. Okay. Now, 
I'm gonna mix it in. Uh, it's nice and hot. Good. Nice and wet. Look at that. Nice and wet. This here. I've seasoned the sauce. The pasta has salt. Hard for me to eat hot, hot food. So, ready? Yeah. Oh man. Taste is so good. Man. There's nothing like homemade American cheese. It's simple. Kids like it. And I like it too. Dinner is served. Oh yes, 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 yes. And I forgot about this, look. Uh, let me see. Boom. Yeah, see? We got the herb and garlic bread dinner.